Hey guys, what's cooking? Today we have some Dr. Pepper chicken drumsticks. I saw this recipe like a year ago and I wanted to do it mainly because the comments were negative and I was like, how can something involving Dr. Pepper be negative? It's like my favorite soda. Gotta love those empty calories, right? But I wanted to try it out for myself, so here we go. Let's try it out. So for your ingredients, you're going to want some ketchup, a can of Dr. Pepper, tomato paste, Worcestershire sauce, onion powder, chili powder, some salt and some black pepper, and of course your drumsticks. And uh, we will have exact measurements as we um, go through the video. Okay, so this really doesn't take too long to prep all this. So your first step should be preheating your oven. So just preheat it to 425. And then get out a baking sheet and you can line it up if you want. Uh, a lot of the time I just, you know, cook right on the sheet, but this is going to be messy. And yeah, so me personally, I'm putting some tin foil onto my pan. Um, but totally up to you. Depends on how much you value your pans, right? <laughs> and then you're going to get a medium pan and you're just going to put it over medium heat and we're going to start combining our ingredients. So you're going to put in one and a half cups of ketchup, two tablespoons of tomato paste, and then I just like to stir it at this point because it's pretty thick ketchup and tomato paste, right? So just stir it up a bit and then we're going to add the can of Dr. Pepper. My logic here was if we stir it up, then it's not going to like splash all over the place if we're stirring it with a can of soda in it. So yeah, but totally up to you, I guess. One tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce and one teaspoon of onion powder. And then also half a teaspoon of chili powder. And you're just going to stir it up, bring it to a simmer, and this will be roughly four to six minutes. So just cook it up for four to six minutes. Okay, so that part's done. Like I said, it's not going to take you too terribly long. Now we're getting the drumsticks ready and just place them in a large bowl. And you can season them with some salt and pepper if you want. So we'll pour three-fourths of this mixture over the chicken to coat it and then you're just going to place your chicken onto your baking sheet and bake for 30 to 35 minutes. Okay so it's been 30 minutes now. I've come back to get the chicken and I am just going to uh, grab the rest of the sauce because we didn't use it all, right? So grab the rest of the sauce and just pour it on. You can also flip your chicken as well if you want. And we're going to do an extra five minutes of baking. Okay, and here's our final product. I really enjoyed these. I don't know what those commenters were really referring to. Uh, my guess is maybe they don't like Dr. Pepper soda to begin with, or maybe they just don't like their chicken dolled up with a bunch of sauce. It's This was amazing, guys. Like, 100%, I totally recommend this. Uh, yeah, it, it was so good. Basically, if you like barbecue chicken drumsticks, you're gonna like this one. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. So have a great one, guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.